Hello friends and welcome to BISpecialution.com along with my business partner Tricon Technology Group. My name is Amit and today I am going to show you how to install and configure SmartView. So we would use SmartView to access planning and budgeting cloud service. Let's understand some of the key points before we start working into SmartView. As you know, SmartView is a one integrated and common client Excel based plugin through which you can connect to various Oracle EPM product. If you're already working into SmartView or you have past experience with SmartView, uh, we used to have a two different installer for Windows 64 and 32 bit, but starting from 11, 1 to 4, there's only single installer. So it made the installation process quite easy. Unlike in prior release, you don't need to have a admin privileges. You can install a smart view without admin privilege. And make sure before you start install smart view, your system has .NET Framework 4.5. Otherwise, system will pop up an error message stating that your system is not compatible for smart view before you start using smart view for pbcs make sure you download the latest version and i've already mentioned over here the link from where you could download the latest version let me copy and paste you need to have a oracle credential you can create oracle credentials through otn as i'm already logged in it did not ask me username and password click on the latest download latest version and you can download the latest version as I already downloaded into my system and it is available over here it is 11125710 the last release I think it done on 3rd of September 3rd of August 2017 so this is the latest batch once you download it, you find there's an executable file available, Smart View. For the first time, when you run it, it unzip. And then when you next run it second time, it doesn't require you to unzip it. You can invoke installer. It's pretty straightforward because in my case, Oracle Home, Oracle EPM Home is already set. Therefore, this is gray out. Although you can change this as well. So I would like to install my Smart View with the default location. Go on. One sec. I supposed to close all the Microsoft component, including Excel, PowerPoint, and Word before you should invoke this. Now it takes few minutes to install it. The installation fairly straightforward. You continue to click on next, next. I'm using Windows 64 bit. The installation done successfully. You can cross check. Probably you can go to your control panel. There's one way in the program and feature you find Oracle Microsoft, Oracle Smart View, configure for MS Office. In addition to this, you can also log into your, uh, open your Excel and there you can see Smart View component is connected. Smart View. Once your Smart View installed, the next step is to connect your PBCA with smart view so you need a url so there's a url i already mentioned in my ppt the url may change the server name differ from your and mine because this is my server detail so in order to connect to your smart view you need to define your server detail port number this part will continue to be same on this part changes which i specified as dark color the bold color so i would copy this url and create a private connection go to excel smart view under your panel 
you have two option as the previous release private and shared connection i'm going to create a private connection with quick url copy and paste the url over here and you would be able to connect it will ask you to provide credentials you provide your credential once you specify credential you specify your url and you would see a smart view option appear over here my application is configured with vision sample application there's an alternate and easy way of doing it as well an alternate way once installation is done you can log into your pbcs application and to refresh right now i have access to planning testing application it takes some time to open launch your service and there you can open data form or ad hoc grid open data form any sample data form and open the data form in a smart view this is an alternate way of accessing through smart view scroll down the bottom you have option open in smart view make sure you install the smart view which is compatible with your pbcs latest version here it is so you can either define url of your private connection or you can directly open through your browser so that's it for today should you have any question please feel free to write to us you can also watch our other videos about smart view troubleshooting thank you